What's up YouTube, Vape King here and welcome to Vape King Reviews. Today's review is on an RDA, it is on the Twisted Messes RDA. And this RDA I am loving at the moment. I have had this for over a month now. I have been using it on and off. And I've been great, getting great performance and a great flavour off this device. So what we're going to do is we're going to get on with the intro and I'll see you in a couple of seconds. So like I say, today's review is on the Twisted Messes and performance, flavour and vapour is up there. It is up there with those top RDAs that are out currently on the market at the moment. Now, um, I do have a Clapton build in here on my setup today. I've got a dual Clapton build that's ohming out at a 0.2 ohms. I've got this sitting on top of my X-Cube two here and i've got it i'm vaping it at 100 watts at the moment strength hard and um, don't know if i mentioned 0 0.2 um, ohms on the coils there clapton coils great flavor great vapor production on here now um i have primarily been using claptons on here for me there's no other way. Um, I like the flavour and performance of Clapton's, and with the Twisted Messes being being made by Twisted Messes, messes um, got to have some Clapton's on there. It doesn't matter which Clapton you've got on there, just as long as you've got Clapton's for that performance and that flavour. So what we're going to do is we're going to dive up close um, with this device. I am going to put the coils on here in the close-up as well I'm gonna fast track through that but I am gonna put a coil build on this in the close-up so I'll see you after the close-ups I'll come back tell you what I like what I don't like about this RDA and then BAM we'll finish up there so here we are up close with the twisted messes RDA this is the box that it comes in um, it does have a black sticker there. I originally did have the black AFC ring, but I swapped it out with my friend Paul for his blue one, and I'd only get one AFC ring in this kit that I've got. So at the top of the box, it has got Comp Vape. And it's got the Twisted Messes logo there. Twisted Messes at the bottom, Comp Vape Design USA. Got nothing on the side or underneath. So... Let's open the box. So, whoops a daisy. Sorry about that with the camera. So, in the box, in the box, you do get your Twisted Messes RDA, your box, uh, a pack of spares, and three, two other drip tip options in there. So, your bag of spares, you do get an Allen key, some O rings. Pre-made coils, extra grub screws, extra 510 screw there, pin there, and some extra insulators there. So that's your spares. So here is your Twisted Messes RDA. So just put that to one side. You do get this Delrin chuff top here. I will show you all of them. And then you do get... do get the 510 as well an adapter there so let's put them to one side so here is the twisted messes rda it does currently have the stainless steel chuff cap on there so you do have twisted messes at the bottom here engraved laser engraved is it yeah laser engraved and there as well so this is a 22 millimeter device 510 threaded silver plated copper center pin there 
304 food grade stainless steel it is made out of and then at the side you do have an 8mm cyclops style AFC with three 3mm three hole joint together on there and you can run this in single or parallel mode top cap is threaded nice and smooth so that's how you would adjust your AFC so whatever you adjust on this side and then close that down will be on the parallel side or if you want to run it in single coil mode you just put the single there and then one side is open other side is closed off there we are so let's just have a quick look underneath you've got some engraving there comp vape and my serial number 14221 so let's start with the chuff cap so this is the stainless steel chuff cap the height currently is 41 millimeters with the stainless steel and the bore on that is 14 millimeters throughout as well from top to bottom so that is the stainless steel chuff, chuff cap this is all one piece Then we have the Delrin wide board chuff cap with the top threaded section and that comes out like that. So the height on this is 44 millimeters in height and the bore of that is 14 millimeters at the top then tapers down to 8 millimeters there. So that's the Delrin one. And this is the 510 adapter. So the height of this is 44 millimeters in height. The 510 drip tip on there. And the bore of this drip tip is 8 millimeters at the top. Then tapers down to 8 millimeters at the bottom. So that's the 510. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to take that out. And I'm going to pop my black Delrin. Because that's the one I have been using. That's the one I prefer. So that's the RDA, let's have a look at the deck. So the deck here, you've got a right nice big deck. You've got two O-rings on, on the deck there. Nice um, tolerance to it, not too hard, not too soft. You do have a six mil deep juice well there. You do have a triple post design with a center T post with two holes. Negative are uh, milled into the deck. I haven't had any spinning issues on this. You do have a 2.8 mil diameter holes there, post holes there, so good for those Claptons. I run Claptons on it. And then you've got some hex grub screws there, which I am a fan of. They don't back out and you get a good solid connection on there. So let's just quickly go back to the top cap. Your top cap does is threaded now doesn't matter which one I put on it's nice and smooth build quality on this RDA is really really nice so let's see if I can get this to focus here get this to focus there we are so as you can see threads on the top cap and then the threads on your barrel nice and smooth AFC ring comes off like that so if you have got one of those um, twisted messes that you do get the different coloured AFC you can swap them out easily like that and then just thread that on top there nice and smooth no burrs no grinding nice and smooth And there's the inside of the barrel there. So 
So that's the inside of the barrel. So that is the Twisty Messes RDA. So what I'm just going to quickly do is I am going to throw some Claptons on here. So I've got some dual Claptons that I've already built here. This is just single fused Claptons. So I've got a 24 gauge core here and a 32 gauge wrapped on the outside. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fit these, heat them up and then we'll go back up top and have a vape on it. So we're back from being up close with the Twisted Messes RDA and Quick Coil build. Now, like I said, I have been using this on and off for just over a month now and I do find this to be a 
excellent top RDA um, to vape on. I've got many, many hours of enjoyment out there with my Clapton's on there. So, so let's go through the cons and I can't find any cons with this um, RDA. It's an excellent RDA. Everything that's on it, the deck space, um, the deck depth, the juice well, um, the AFC, um, the threading on this, you know, is excellent. So I've got no, no um, um, cons um, for this RDA. Positives, right? You do have those big post holes, two point eight millimeters, so you can fit most big Clapton builds in this RDA. You got a nice six mil deep juice well which is also excellent so you can give your RDA a good drip on there. Grub screws, I am a fan of grub screws now. I wasn't originally, but I do find you'd get good, nice connection on there. And I found that my Allen key that I did get with my spares hasn't rounded off so far. It's nice and tight and precise and I get good connection. I get a good crank on it as well when I need to tighten down on those coils. Leaking wise, I haven't had any leaking issues with this, no matter how much I've dripped, if I've over dripped or not over dripped, it hasn't leaked on me. Airflow is nice, you can run it in single and dual coil mode, so that is also a plus. Even though I do not run in single coil mode, sometimes I do, if I'm doing a Clapton build, I might run it in single, but other than that, I do run in dual. So um, I do find that as a con, if you do get one of those eyes that you can't run in single coil um, mode because you need to have that option there as well, which is also good. Now, drip tip options. You get a nice set amount of drip tip options. You get a Delrin, you get a stainless steel chuff type and you do get that 510 adapter plus a 510 drip tip. Now, with mine that I bought, I did buy for $19.99. It is an authentic as well. I did think it was a clone, but I found out from the seller it is an authentic. In my kit, I did only get the one AFC ring, which was a black one originally. But I swapped this over with a good friend, Paul. He liked the black one. I liked his, red, his blue one. So we swapped up there. So, um, other positives, um, I like all the threading on it. Build quality is excellent. Build quality for this, I would give an 8 out of 10. I haven't noticed any birds on the threading whatsoever, even on the 510 pin. There's no birds on there. Birds free. Um, threading is really, really smooth. It's no grinding or anything. It's smooth as anything. I can put the top cap on and just do that right quickly and it'll carry on going. So build quality, 8 out of 10. Now machine oil, I did get a bit of machine oil with this when I did get it, so I did have to clean it. But all round build quality is excellent. Everything's nice and smooth. I like the drip tip options as well. Um, and um, all round a nice RDA. Um, what else? And um, you know, and I've been getting good performance. Nice, adequate airflow. You can switch it off tighter if you want more flavour. But I do have it wide open. I like the airflow. Nice amount of airflow you do get to those coils. Not very restrictive. A nice amount. It's not the best airflow. Right airy, but there's just right amount. I've got no problems with the airflow um, on this. So um, anything else that I'm missing on here? I think I've more or less covered everything that I want to cover on the Twisted Messes RDA. An excellent device. I would give this also an 8 out of 10. It's not as good as my Velocity or Velocity Mini. They're still my number one RDAs at the moment. It's just the flavour on them is, oh, it is. And when you've got a nice juice in there, oh, you just get a, a burst of, a burst of um, flavour from the um, Velocity RDA. If you haven't got one, do get one. I have got a review on the Velocity RDA, so check out that review as well. Great RDA. Um, but the Twisted Messes is there. I would say the Twisted Messes RDA is up there in my top five 
I need to do a top five RDA and devices and stuff and tanks um, review, but that will come up um, shortly as well. So all round nice device. I would recommend this. Eight out of ten for flavour, build quality, and and all that. I will put a link in the description below to where I purchased this from. I did purchase this from eBay, um, and like I say excellent RDA 8 out of 10 so I'm gonna leave it there don't forget you can follow me on Instagram and Facebook vape King reviews you can find me on there and as always people vape safe look after yourself and the people around you thanks for watching stay safe and I'll see you shortly